Uh, oh, really? That's why that was popping. Oh, okay. Yeah, I the first must one have missed was uh, Denobro. Okay, yeah. yeah. Going all the way back. So right now we got field tension, or tension rather. Definitely forgot he changed that uh, versus Cormelia. Yeah, Corn versus Fox. And I really like the Corn pick instead of um, Palutena. Oh, yeah. Not because like I feel like Palutena does particularly bad against Fox, which she probably does, but then um, Tension's play style is just so patient until he gets that one oh, opening. Yeah. He brings it all the way to the bank, already at 85%. Yeah, he's definitely super explosive. His punish game is super on point. Uh, definitely was a, you know, like back when I started coming to Xanadu, he was like a top three player. Oh, yeah. You know, I mean, he it was snow in him in Grand Finals, the first Xanadu I ever came to. Uh, so he's definitely an experienced player, definitely knows what he's doing. Camellia also, though, knows what he's doing. But right now, field tension definitely cleaning him out, only taking 7%. We'll see if uh, Camellia is able to rack up some percent and get back into this. Yeah, and Primaria looks like he's still kind of poised. That was a really good uh, Tomahawk right there in the grab. But um, feel tension, or attention rather, with just those fascinating speeds, and he just automatically sticks that jab out, and it's already netting him a lot of percent. Primaria, most of the damage he's gotten off this stock has just been flat out grabs. Like, yeah, and not being able to follow up after it. Okay, that was a nice spin. Yeah, he's finally answering a little bit back with the pins. But. You know, he still has that really big double climb, and he just keeps on, like, staying patient, getting those grabs. Oh. And that's the start of something big. There you the go. With that forward smash, calling out that landing, taking that first stock way earlier than even Tension expected. Yeah, definitely great stuff coming out, getting that uh, tipper right on there. Um, and, I mean, bringing himself back into this game. 84%. Uh, it's definitely a deficit, but it's not impossible to come back from. Oh, I thought that was the start of something big. Definitely, I mean, already 38% on field tension here. We'll see if uh, tension's able to slow it down, sort of get his, you know, get back into the vibe of uh, this match and close it out. Or if Romelia is able to keep up the pressure and close it out for himself. Yeah, he still has really had like a lot of stage control this whole time. Um, Tension at this point, this is where he shines more than a lot of other foxes. He's very patient mm -hmm. and he has a really good reaction time. So he's not going to really overextend, take a lot of risks just to get kills uh -huh. until he really feels the need to. Right. So um, there's probably a solid 20, 30 percent before tension starts like playing in. I'm gonna do something silly. Tension percents. Yeah, definitely. Looking for that up air, almost killing, not quite. Uh, another up air probably will take it. That was a nice uh, option to get on stage. Yeah, this is actually one of uh, Core's oh, better stages. Nice tension. raw back air. Yeah, I think he knew that he was going to DI away, just get off that yeah. platform, and just yeah. called him on that landing space right there. Yeah. Beautiful work. Great uh, stuff. Something I forgot to mention about Tension earlier is that his reaction time, I say this every time, like, he's playing on stream, but we haven't seen him in a while, so I'll say it one last time. His reaction time is bar none the best in the MBBA. I'll say it. Yeah. I All agree, right. j Dog. Oh, hey, Tanless on the mic, ladies and gentlemen. Woo. What's up, Tan? Hey, Real ladies quick. and gentlemen, thank you for joining us tonight. We are benefiting direct relief yep. and you guys uh, have already been sending in your donations uh who, who are we read next Where all right we next off? we have aurelius mac and he said i think he just wanted to set on stream but here you go purple monkey dishwasher wait is that oh that's like the that's uh the mountain Dew, that's like the mountain dew like purple monkey or uh baby monkey uh puppy what what yeah that that's mountain that's the mountain dew commercial it's they're just oh, like baby yeah. monkey puppy or something I like that. Puppy, yeah. puppy monkey baby. Puppy monkey baby. Yeah, that was it. And there then we have uh, Gresh with the two dollars. Hey, look, a charity stream. Better donate. You guys right. need to follow Gresh's example. Hey, everybody, if, in if the everybody chat. watching donated two dollars, we'd have our gold medal oh. already. Like, oh yeah, we would have a huge. We would be way over. And uh, there we go. We're at three twenty-two. We're getting up there. We're heading into game two. Promelia versus Tension. Yep. Now, uh, J Dog. Tell me about Promelia on Duck Hunt here, because I don't know what his obsession is with this level, but he seems to take everyone here. Um, and the thing is, at least the matches that I've seen, his track record on this level isn't necessarily amazing. Um, I guess he just wants the like uh, extra space and maybe mm -hmm. the platform space yeah. to slow things down yeah. and like you know recollect himself. But he wasn't really losing on the fact that he wasn't able to collect himself. He was losing because he just wasn't able to get damage, and tension is just doing the thing he's doing right now, juggling. <laughs> Speaking of not getting damage, that was eighty. <laughs> 85 from nothing. Yeah, this is looking much like the first match. Uh, uh, I'll tell you, the tension always picks the stage oh. two, so I'm not really... Oh, oh catches no. him. Jeez. Man. The Fox 50-50 right there. Well, he essentially got a 50-50 off that up air into another up air. Yeah. Well, Promelia did uh, only get 7% on uh, tension last time, and he brought it back almost to even. Uh, so we'll see if he's able to bring it back again. Yeah. For B and B, we're not talking about bed and breakfast <laughs> right now. <laughs> yeah, 
The down tilt to uh, up tilt is a really good combo on Fox, especially since he falls so fast. Yeah. But speaking of combos, oh potentially goodness. with the perfect pivots coming through, 44%. Yeah, then they're definitely going to help you out as Corrin going to come out, I believe, frame three. Um, yeah. So definitely can get you out of a lot of stuff. Yeah, I think it's like forced, but like it's still mad fast. I oh, yeah. It's, yeah. It's super fast, that's for sure. Definitely a good option. Yeah. That encounter to break out of combos. I think it's looking a okay. little rough here for uh, our good friend from Amelia, but yeah, he's starting to bring it back a little bit. We're out of extra credit territory. Yeah, the thing about this stock is that if you look at it in isolation, Actually, Promelio was playing pretty well. It's just honestly the first stock where he was getting freed up. I like that option a lot because the Firefox um, had a better chance of clanking with uh, uh, side B if you decide to do it. Yeah, good decision. Good decision. Yeah. Well, Romelio better step it up or he's going to be donating his stock oh. to charity. And there it is. There, yeah. Yep. Just it's the start of something. It, it, when, it, when in doubt with Corrin, just honestly just stick out that pin. Oh, such yeah. a good option. Maybe not against Fox as much, but like it'll let you kill sometimes. Yeah, definitely uh, tension. Still being very patient. Promelia, though, you good, getting a lot of good uh, shield grabs here. So uh, we'll see if he's able to keep that up. I mean, he has started to bring it back already, uh, just like last game. We'll see if he's able to actually close it out this time or if tension is just going to not let him rack up the percent and just take it out. Yep. Um, last time we did see tension just kind of let some hits happen that he really shouldn't. And Honestly, the trend is still continuing, 59%. And a lot of it was essentially unanswered because when Premier took that stock, he was definitely at like 80, 90. Yeah. Yeah, he was high up there. Yeah, so. he was up there at like 90, I think. Yeah. What, the one thing he could do is he has the option to use like side B wall jumps and stuff on the stage. I mean, maybe right. we never see him do it, but the option's there. Oh, gets the up uh, air dodge, gets the KO. Up. There it is. Yep. All right, we have some donations real quick. Brian Fury93, please support. Actually, no, sorry. We have Jed12 first for $2. I just want to see my two favorite zero set. Zero